Well, I'm not in the slightest bit pissed off. Uh, I've just cut the wires on this and put them all back on. <laughs> I forgot to put that on. Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. I don't, it just, it, it's only me. Only me. I cut it straight off and put it straight back on again. Finally, I've got it together. Oh, it's been a nightmare. Well, no, it hasn't. It's been straightforward. I'm just too bloody meticulous, that's what it is. Anyway, before I put it together, before I do the final buttoning up, that's the BMS on, and the throttle. And the brake. I don't know why, but this resonates through this platform. The, the motor itself doesn't seem to make any noise, it's just the noise going through the platform. And it always has done. Anyway, I'm going to button it all up and then it's done. Tighten the nuts up properly. Jobs are good. If you if you got one of these things, for God's sake, get the 10 inch wheels, the tyres, uh, the suspension. I don't need it anymore. It's a hell of a lot smoother with these tyres on. It's fantastic. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's still bloody bumpy. It's still very, very bumpy. Oh shit. I have got no brake. No brake at all. Well, this has taken quite a lot of work to get it done. I just went out, went down the road, after doing 20 something miles an hour and found out I've got no brakes, which is a bit worrying. Uh, yeah, I did manage to stop. <laughs> I've taken it all apart again. Uh, plugged it all into the, um, the software and I can't find anything, there's nothing seems to be wrong. So I reset all the defaults, set everything up again. So now, if I open the throttle, So that's all working. Now if I enable flux weakening, I let go and regen kicks in. So I'm going to charge it all up again and I'm going to take it out for another test. I've increased the um, the e-brake current from 10 to 20 amps. I just hope that the I know the battery will take it. Is it the battery I'm worried about? What am I worried about? It's the motor I'm more worried about than anything. I mean, 20 amps is a lot to go through this bloody motor, but you know. Anyway, that's about run about our throttle now. I don't want to give it any more throttle yet. Bloody hell, that's... It seems to be pulsing. Isn't that a sign that it's about to um, give in? Bloody hell, this thing goes. Regen sort of works. After a look at the logs. The regen's a bit weird because it comes in and comes out. It's still on, still on. It does feel a bit weird. And let's give it some. Bloody hell! I don't want to go over any bumps whatsoever. I think this is the absolute maximum it'll go. Holy 
you shit. I ain't gonna get any more out of it than that. Yeah, I'm not talking a lot because I'm f shitting myself, man. I'm shaking, I am shaking. Shaking like a bloody leaf. My God, that was, uh, that was scary. Very, 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 very f scary. Strangely, that motor isn't hot, it's warm. Wow. It isn't hot. I honestly thought that'd be bloody burning there. Oh well, that is the test, that is the final test, that is how fast it goes, whatever the speed was. Well, uh, thanks for watching ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Catch you later. <laughs> Remember, life's definitely worth living. Unless you're Tony. Um, keep smiling. And bollocks! to what anybody else thinks. <laughs> uh.